Hey guys, Fan Sleeping Panda here, and I'm gonna show you my Elgato uh, Elgato game capture device. I got a game capture, an Elgato HD60S. Now for this Elgato, you need a good uh, PC. So I bought this uh, new PC. Check out my Angry Bird, and this is the Elgato. It's uh, backwards, but uh, yeah, you have to put the HDMI from the Xbox One into it, a USB-C cable, 3.1 USB, then you have the HDMI cable that goes to your monitor, that goes here, I don't know if you can see that, but yeah, it's just doing that, and I'm converting uh, some trials now. <laughs> um, yeah, so you have so you have to use a great computer to get this to work. You also need a USB 3.0 because it's the new uh, Elgato one. And I'm gonna show you the specs that you need. Focus, fucking thing. There you go. Okay, uh, you, system requirements. Windows 10, internet connection, you need a 4th generation quad core Intel Core i5 CPU or higher than that and you need an Intel HD or NVIDIA GeForce GTX 600. You need 4, gig, four gigabytes of RAM built in USB 3.0 as I said. Okay, and I got this uh, computer. This is my uh, computer specs. Come on, focus, stupid thing. Okay. Fo Damn it. I got a hard disk uh, Toshiba, two terabyte. I got an SSD Toshiba. Okay, that's not mess. I got an Asus uh, motherboard Prime H270 Plus. I got a processor, an Intel i7 6700K. I got eight gigabytes of memory. I got a Cooler Master. A few column masters. Oh, and I also have a GTX. Uh, I don't have the. Maybe I have it. Oh, there it is. I have the box also. It's an NVIDIA GTX 1050 Ti. It has uh, 4 gigabytes DDR5. Uh, yeah, it's a very fast uh, video card. Some specs, chipsets, direct DirectX of Yeah, it's very fast. So uh, yeah, <laughs> and this this is the motherboard. It's a really big box. Focus. There you go. Uh, There we go, uh, headers, USB 3.0, 32 gigs per second, 4 gigabyte DDR4, yep, that's it. Yeah, so that's what you need for the Elgato HD60S, and you also have the software for it. Okay, I'm gonna show you the software now for the game capture. I'm using a tripod now, so uh, start, thank you. Okay, so this is the software. Oh. Okay, of course. Of course, there's no signal now, but uh, yeah. If I put on my Xbox uh, One, so yeah, put on the Xbox One. And then the signal will appear. There you go. Just uh, you also hear the sounds on your uh, on your computer device. Yeah, and so you can edit uh, the ones. 
you can edit this one here. I mean records, and then uh, you can also uh, just picking up the tripod now. <laughs> there you go. You have a game capture HD 60s, 1080p, 60 frames per second. <coughs> this is my uh, YouTube uh, channel, and there you have it. So yeah, that's it. And if you do nothing on the mouse, you get a full screen like this. So Ooh. So yeah, just start up now, please. Thank you. Okay, guys. Now this is uh, really important. Come on. Now if you want to hear your uh, party on the Xbox uh, One. So um, you have to use this settings. You go to all settings from the Xbox. And then we just let this appear. Come on. This up here. Thank you. Go full screen. Then you go to display and sound. Then you go to volume. And then you put the party chat output to headset and speakers, which is already on mine. And uh, yeah, and if you're doing some something solo, you just put it on headset because you don't want to hear the guys that are talking in a party. Uh, I think so. Just put the headset and the speakers on if you are in a multiplayer. Okay. Oh, and also uh, this is very important. You need to have an an external microphone. So I have an uh, I have a Trust uh, USB microphone. It's just a simple microphone for 25 bucks, I think. And uh, yeah, it's a it's a really good microphone for it. And you have to, you have to plug it in in the the USB. But I don't. I yeah, I got a USB adapter, but. I can just plug it in in the microphone uh, output. There you go. And this is the microphone with the blue cable. Very cool. Thank you, Bert. <laughs> and also, if you are uh, recording, you have to use the. Oh, sorry, sorry. Come on, get up. Arrgh. Stay there, okay. If you are using the Elgato external mic, you have to put on the comments. And because then the Elgato uh, speaks, speaks up. So, uh... so yeah, here we go. And then uh, we put uh, the commenting on. You have to put it on to record your voice. And uh, yeah, so just start up the game now and then it will be all good. So uh, guys, if you enjoyed this video, uh, click like and subscribe and I see you in another one. Goodbye.